Hi there, this is Steve. This is Jeremy. And we're the Alabama Gamers. Bringing you an unboxing video for Loot Gaming for the month of October 2017. What's in the box? What is in the box? No clue. Right. So we got the loot gaming loot box. Loot gaming. All right. So, so what was uh? What's the thing? Demon. Demon. Yeah. Demon. So, is there something you expect? I know that they got some Doom stuff and some Diablo. Oh, it's got to be. Yeah. So probably right. heavy on those two franchises. Too, yes. Uh, so if you subscribe to Loot Gaming for the month of October 2017, and you would see this. Oh. Right off the bat. Right, so a Space Marine from Doom. Yeah, just like I said. And it's a pop figure, mm -hmm. so it's really good. Um, it's got the big head. It's got his weapon there. Let's go ahead and pull her out here. Let's see there, this is number 90. There's a Cyber Demon that they make for this as well. He came out fairly easy. Now, he's light, you know. Mm -hmm. They're probably going to display is. him in the box. Yeah. 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 But, you know, the pop figures are, I know that they're big. They're not our favorites because, you know. But, you know, they're still cool. Yeah. I mean, there is a lot of people that love these. So. Hey, if you like the franchise, that's just what really matters. If you like the franchise, you'll yeah. like it. Not mm -hmm. All right. Next up is a pair of Doom shot glasses. Oh, oh they're not just shot glasses too. They're shot glasses. I know, they're shells. shot shells. Yeah, that is pretty cool. So you know, take your shots. So shot, 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 shot. Or drink your apple juice in it, you know. So normally they say uh uh, what are they? Toothpick holders. Toothpick yes. holders. Or mini glasses. Oh wow, these are nice. Yeah. Alright, what's the guy here? Oop. So they are uh, shaped like shotgun mm -hmm. shells. Do not microwave cold liquids only. Cold liquids only. You know what? That's a it's plastic. Man, nobody want to drink a shot out of plastic. Well, it's yeah. still cool though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's Doom. Uh, I don't think you're going to be able to wash it in the washing machine. No. That the Doom's going to come out. Yeah. But it's cool looking. You probably wouldn't use it very much anyway. You're probably just going to display it. Yeah. So yeah. that's that's neat. Like that. That is cool. All right. Uh, next up, I guess, is that. All right. So we've got a shirt. We do. We do. Of course, it's a black shirt because of the theme. Mm -hmm. And we've got a Diablo shirt, which. It's pretty cool looking. I mean, you could wear that to a heavy metal concert. Yeah, that is pretty gnarly. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Soft shirt. Yeah. Soft shirt. Yeah. Well, you know, they always do the cotton shirts, and those yeah, are always yeah. really nice that they breathe. So that's what we've got. It's cotton. You just have to wash. You have to watch the way you wash them. Mm -hmm. so. All right. Next up is a Lords of the Daedra book. Uh, it's a hardcover book. It is 64 pages. Getting a lot of nice books. Here yeah, we right. are. Um, for those who don't know, this is uh, this uh, is in reference to a Skyrim, uh, Elder Scrolls. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I mean, it's a book. It's got. Uh, hmm. Looks like it's got a little exploration. Yeah, Maybe you don't get from the game. It. Yeah. Your little backstories on some of your uh, mm -hmm. enemies, things like that. So. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Cool. Like that ish. All right, next up is. Oh, we got some playing cards. Um, so it's probably pretty standard playing cards. Oh, me up. See, well, there's a little thing here. I don't have to do that. So we'll get that off there. Demons and Devil playing cards. So it doesn't look like there's. Oh, it's from Dungeons and Dragons. Okay. Oh, nice. Yeah. So it's right on top of it. So right off the get go, you know, you've got Incubus as a Joker. Uh, not real sure how to say that name. The Dritch. A lot of different characters on there. From. So they all different. Yeah. Well, you're probably gonna have the same thing on like. Yeah, it looks like they're all different. Oh wow. They're different on the. Uh, there you got a chain devil, bone devil. Looks like uh, there's a theme for the hearts here. There's a lot of devils, a lot of red in there, mm -hmm. and different things for the red. Now I did see one of those on the uh, spades card. So yeah, and they're nice cards. You know, they're okay. standard playing cards. So, yeah, you know, it's neat. Let's see. Let's see a little test of the cards is in there. 
Mm -hmm. In the action. Yeah. They feel good. Mm -hmm. They feel good. Except they float. So. So we'll see if we can get make this one float at the top. Oh, oh goodness, look at that. It does float. It's possessed. <laughs> All right, next up is the Loop Pin for Loop Gaming, which I really like. They're kind of coin shaped always, uh, mm -hmm. most of the time at least. And this is of a spit uh, 50 cal. And I love the way they have the firing pin marked just slightly off center so it looks realistic mm -hmm. uh, because it never hit top center. center. Uh, it's kind of sharp, man. It's two toed. It's a really good looking pin. Yeah, I right. like that. That's, that's one of my favorites out of this. So yeah, far. yeah. It's, it's cool. I like that. All right. And. I think that'll be the last item. We've got our poster. We always get a poster with the gaming. And it looks like Doom. Yep. We got Doom on here. Looks like he's fighting a bunch of demons. Looks like he may be in right in the middle of the hell. Uh, all right. Demon thing. We'll grab that in there. Oh, yes. Just for a second there so we can show this poster so you can see all the action going on. You got your Space Marine right in the middle, surrounded by demons. So, you know, it's a cool looking poster, especially if you like Doom. Yeah. You know, they've got some, uh, you know, Doom's coming to the Switch. Mm -hmm. They've got Doom VR coming out. So, Ooh. you're going to be What's saying, the Epic Drop this month? Oh, uh, the Epic Drop had something to do with PlayStation and Bethesda. Well, I don't know if I figured that up. I knew I was going to read that. All right, Epic Drop is the Bethesda Bundle, which includes Doom VR and Skyrim uh, VR. Uh, two very cool games for VR. And you get the PlayStation Pro, Woo! the good one. Yeah. Uh, the PSVR and the Skyrim VR, Doom VFR. So, yeah, it's a $900 value. So some lucky guy or gal got something really, really cool. So, yeah. Oh, man, I wish I had Because I was... And I to love qualify, that. you have to pay for your subscription, so you can't be mm -hmm. um, someone like Boogie2988 who uh, gets free crap or whatever. You got to pay for it, mm -hmm. and you got to get the Loot and Loot DX, or Gaming Loot and Loot Gaming. You got to get two of them, and we subscribe to five altogether, mm -hmm. uh, and I'm about to pick up the, the Minecraft for my kid, I think. So uh, we certainly qualify. You send it to us if you want. We appreciate you. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, and last up is this cool-looking box. I don't know really what this is in reference to, but it's a pretty cool-looking, funky box here. So we have the gods offering loot yeah, crate. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then we got some eye. We got a sword. We got an antler. Another reference to loot crate here. That's one of their logos. So pretty cool, pretty funky little box. I keep the boxes. The boxes are pretty pretty awesome so all right well at the end of the day we pay for all this crap mm -hmm. uh i think it's a neighborhood of 33 dollars what we actually ended up paying because mm -hmm. we bought it by the year and i got it for a discount well when i signed up it just as you should mm -hmm. uh, try to be patient wait for a good discount done and my whole year of it at that cheap price mm -hmm. and all you right. got holidays coming up so i'm sure they're going to be pumping out some holiday discounts. i would i would hope so you know so all right first up is well we'll just start this way the poster what do we give the posters uh poster usually about two bucks three bucks something like that yeah yeah, 250. That's about what's going to cost you. Oops. 250. All right, what's next? Uh, playing cards. Playing cards. What do you say? Um, a good set of playing cards going to cost you around three or four bucks. So I'd say about five being licensed with the uh, Dungeons and Dragons. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let's say 750. Because I last time I bought playing cards, they were five bucks. I haven't bought them in a while. Yeah, they were <laughs> five bucks. And because they tax them now because mm. they're gambling. Mm -hmm. um, so these are officially licensed products, not by Loot Crate, but these are Dungeons and Dragons licensed. You can tell by the ampersand sign that stylized ampersand. So 750 maybe? Mm -hmm. Okay. Sounds uh, good to me. They're slick. They're not cheap. Oh, we've had some cheapo cards. These are awesome cards. Mm -hmm. What's next? So we've got our book. When, like I said, the book is a great quality. Mm -hmm. It's got a you know pretty good shine on it. Lots of pages in here. It's a, it looks like there's 57 in the uh, chapters of interest. Mm -hmm. So 64 pages all together. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So as a if you're a Skyrim fan, mm -hmm. you're probably gonna pay about 10 bucks for something like this, okay. maybe. So what do we say? Maybe 750. Yeah. I'm not because we're, we're not a big fan. Skyrim fan, but I know there's a lot out there yeah out there and if you know you guys want to come by this if you're in the Huntsville area soon we're going to be there Comic Con or Hamicon 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 so we'll be there Hamicon we've got the uh, we'll go ahead and do the pump because uh, these are pretty easy because they're pretty standard at uh, $9.99 uh -huh. so uh, you know just go ahead and round it up to the $10 $10 yeah. 
I was so that's pretty standard for those you know, unless you find them on a deal mm -hmm. <clears throat> like that um, then you've got your shot glasses uh, they are plastic they are so that's going to knock the price a little bit but they are cool though I just wanted them to be met or yeah, glass they're, they're so going to be more of a display than an actual sure. uh, using yeah mm -hmm. uh, what do you think uh, I've never bought shot glasses. Well, I bought souvenir shot glasses and used those like 10 bucks for one. Uh -huh. So I would say probably around 10. If, you know, if you went to Hot Topic or maybe GameStop or something like that, this is probably going to cost you 10. Okay. For mm -hmm. the set? Yeah, for the okay. set. All right, 10 it is. Mm -hmm. And then we've got our shirt. And we like the shirt. The shirt, you know, of course, is 100% cotton. It's soft. It's got a really cool logo. Even if you're not in Diablo, I mean, you. You can wear this to your heavy metal concert, you know, you're going to look cool. Yeah. And some people are going to get the reference, and some people are going to like, man, that is a really cool devil shirt. <laughs> it's like, rock on, man. Rock on, man. man. Yeah, man. So, I would say about 15. Yeah, 12, 15, maybe. Just mm -hmm. one color. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you would do 15. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do that. A lot of deep because you, you're right. Design. You can't wear a lot of different places. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's not going to be just your video game. And then we've got the uh, pen, which oh, we both pen. really like this pen. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to bump it up from my usual 250 from pen and say mm -hmm. three for that. Done. Yeah. So that's a great pen. Okay. I love it. So I think we paid someone in the neighborhood. I gotta I gotta write down what we pay for these crap because I can't remember. We got so many now. Uh, I think we paid someone in the neighborhood about thirty five dollars. This great checks in at fifty five fifty, mm -hmm. which is really good twenty dollars extra value uh it's all gaming the franchise is on point the box turns into something hey, they're great franchises. i love too. yeah they're solid franchises i mean uh skyrim is on like every single platform and they've released it like a hundred times uh doom is awesome diablo people just love diablo uh everything is legit you know um, i like it uh, mm -hmm. so good box good box you think like i fit in the theme of demons good yeah I, I do i mean it was hard uh you know you don't have a whole lot maybe to pick from from that you know you're gonna hit those right. certain franchises i don't think it's too heavy on anything you mm -hmm. know we did get uh two doom items but we uh we've got the uh, diablo shirt with the dungeons and dragons cards yeah so the thing about the pin which i love the pin the most but you you got this pin if you like diablo if you like any any shooting game so this is really sweet so. all right well i guess until then Roll time. Roll time. Like, subscribe, share. You know, let everybody know. You'll see this video coming up on Facebook. So hit us on the likes for the Alabama gamers. You know, tell your friends.